Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Sugar Moto. On this episode, commuter jeans from Atwild. Yeah! Um, I love these jeans. They're really, I don't know if you can see, they're really, really deep, inky, inky navy black. And I, um, I did a video with them, how I style them, and how I wear it with my Atwild jacket for writing. So I'll put a link to that video at the end of this so you can see the full fit on me. It's a little bit hard in this capacity to uh, try these on for you, but I will tell you all the other fabulous details right now. They are Kevlar lined stretch jeans. Now, I love these because you have a higher rise in the back so you're not gonna get your tramp stamp, if you have one, hanging out the back of your jacket. They made the Atwild um, all-time moto jacket a little bit longer and they made these a little bit higher so they come right above your belly button. Now, I mean, sorry, not above it, right below your belly button and it goes up a good portion, way higher than most Kevlar pants that are available in the marketplace um, in the back. So you're not gonna have that skin exposed between your jacket and your jeans, which has been a big problem when I'm looking at denim and jackets for riding. So Atwell solved that problem with these commuter jeans. Now, you can see that there is, can you see it? Meow. I might put up picture. I'm gonna put pictures in too, so you can really see the details. There is quilting here, boop, and there's accordion here. Oh yeah, there you can see it. And you can see the dog hair, because I was snuggling my dog when I was wearing these last night. Um, accordion pleats here. You've got the quilting there at the bottom. And you've got the quilting here, boop, boop, where normally a pocket would be. Um, the quilting and the accordion is all the awesome stretch Kevlar on the inside. So these are super comfortable. I wore them to dinner last night. I know that if some some jean passes the dinner test that I can eat in them and expand in my belly, <laughs> sorry, um, but women know what I'm talking about, and still be comfortable in these suckers, then I'm gonna be able to ride in them for 68 hours a day. So this is the jam when it comes to a nice riding jean. Now the other thing I like about it is the Kevlar does keep me warm. So. I also, somehow it keeps me cool. I don't know how that works, but uh, I wore these just, I'm wearing them actually in New York when it's freezing cold in the winter because they're just really good, heavy, warm jeans. And um, the, the Kevlar kind of goes throughout all the way to the bottom, so you can see here, in all the major impact zones on the jeans. So you have them in the hip, you have them in the knee, and you have them in the shin. Um, and around the butt area. So underneath all the pocketing in the back pockets, you have the Kevlar. So every important area, I mean, I think the most important thing about this jean, other than the Kevlar, is the fit. Anya really did a supreme fit. I have never, I've tried on a lot of the technical women's jeans or like gear, riding gear. Um, with the Kevlar and the challenge is that the fit is like super duper 90s. It's not exactly the kind of fit that we as modern women who are keep up with fashion want to wear. So that's the great thing about these jeans is that they are actually in a current style and I think a classic style. Um, they remind me of a Louis Vuitton jean that Nicolas Gisquier would do um, for Louis Vuitton or Balenciaga. So psh, works for me. I wear these in my real life too. Um, but it's just, it's also nice that they're an inky, inky dark blue because then I can wear them with my denim shirts, white t-shirts, army shirts, and then they also go really well with all my black stuff. I'm really obsessed with navy and black right now anyway. So from a fashion standpoint, that's kind of how I feel about these guys. Um, check them out. They're on Atwild's website available to purchase. I got a size 30. I'm normally a 28, 29, but because these are high waisted, I went up. Um, I went up a size just for extra comfort. So, I mean, I didn't really go up a size just because I'm usually a 29. So I went to a 30 just to have a little bit of extra room, but they are stretchy. So they're awesome. I love them. Check out the commuters. Um, they're $310 and yeah, uh, the best 
currently jeans on the market from Atwild for writing. So I'll see you guys in the next episode of Sugar Moto. Check you later.